Team of the Season is finally here. If you're looking to get yourself any coins from the best supplier in town, check out my sponsor, FIFACoinZone.com, and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off. How is it going, lads? Welcome back to a brand new video. Now, EA have released, finally, some form of Premier League upgrade SBC pack that we can grind to try and get ourselves some Team of the Seasons. Now, they're going to be out until, I think, Friday. They've got two days remaining, and I am recording this on Wednesday. If you're wondering when they came out, it was at midnight between Tuesday and Wednesday. They... They release these, they, they tweet out something silly like, you asked for upgrade packs, haha, <laughs> here you go, we're heroes, and to be honest, they're definitely not what we wanted. Now, they're extraordinarily expensive compared to what we wanted. We wanted the Premier League 25k packs, as it just costs 11 rares from any league, and it costs maybe like between eight and 11,000 coins to complete, and you get yourself a Premier League 25k pack, and they're really easy to grind. You get 12 players back, and you can just keep repeating and repeating, and the grind is incredible. Instead, we have got 11 Premier League players required with 70 chemistry uh, to get ourselves two players that are 81 or above. Now, the annoying thing is these packs are actually very good. I made a video last night on these. I opened up, I think, like eight or nine, and uh, and I was I was reacting to them. Now I've cut out the intro completely from that video because I was really negative towards the eight, and I just didn't think it's something I wanted to put on the channel. So instead, what I've done is I'll show you guys the packs right now, or sorry, right in a second, should I say, uh, so you guys can see what we packed. We did pack ourselves a team of the season, so. You know, you'll see that in just a second. Uh, but I also want to show you guys the easiest way to grind these out and get them built quickly um, and then open up some for you guys to watch. So here are the packs that I opened last night. Okay, so we have seven built. Now, these are very expensive and will become even more expensive as time goes by uh, up until the end of Premier League team of the season. But we have seven of them built. Hopefully, we can see some pretty good pulls. So we've got seven. We're guaranteed two 81 plus Premier League players in these. Hopefully, we get a walkout in at least one of the seven. If we don't, I'll be very, very upset because I feel, I feel like we deserve a walkout. And if we if we do get a lot of players that aren't great, we can then resubmit them into the SBC. As we get two Man United midfielders there, not a bad start. Um, we'll, we'll resubmit them and we'll open up more. I do have a Premier League Tots pack to show you at the end of this video as well. So, at least you guaranteed one Premier League team of the season in this video. So, we're one down and we haven't packed anything yet. We've got six to go. Let's see if we can get something good. We've got a walkout. Come on, be blue. It's not a blue. Okay, it's not blue. All right, yeah. All right, it's going to be French goalkeeper. Hugo Lloris, 88 rated, not too bad. It's going to be good fodder for SBCs uh, if they choose to overprice more Premier League, or not Premier League, if they choose to overprice more Team of the Season SBCs, at least we have Hugo Lloris. Uh, so, so we've got him. Uh, can we get two walkouts in one pack? That'd be surprising if we can. No, we can't. We've got just gone again, though. I'll take 8 year Ray Larissa. That's pretty decent. Not too bad. Uh, we'll store him in the club. We've got five left. Hopefully, we can get more walkouts. I want to get at least one blue. EA, come on. Can we get back to back walkouts? That is a question. No, we cannot, sadly. But can we get a board in this one? Yes, we can. Okay. Go on. Be 85 rated. I don't even know who is 85 rated, to be honest. It's going to be Juan Mata, 83. It's all right. It's not, it's not the worst, not the best. At least I know now. I think we've got enough golds now to then complete another one so we've got at least one more after these uh, after these packs as well we've got four left ea i just want to see one blue i like collecting untradeables one blue would be amazing no walkout in this pack no board in this pack why am i opening these packs <laughs> no i mean it's on me for opening them of course um at the end of the day i am opening them so i can't complain too much because i am opening them but if i wasn't doing it for content i personally would stay away and if you are if you're not a pack addict you don't have a ridiculous amount of coins or you're just sane, I wouldn't do these SBCs. They're just not worth it. Uh, as I'm doing it for content, that is the only reason why I'm completing these SBCs. And I would stay away if I wasn't doing it for content. Um, so, we've got three left. Come on, EA, please. Walk out. Let's go. Come on. Please be blue. Not a blue. It's an inform. I don't... Uh, Shah, maybe? Belgian striker. Michi Batshuayi. I mean, it's an 86 inform. We'll take it, but we want blues, EA. Come on, we want blues. We want some blues. I mean, the only informs I know of this week were actually Shah and, uh, and Michi Bachuay. So, I mean, an 86 rated inform is not too bad, to be fair. But we just want to see blues, EA. We just want to see some blues. And we get Giroud in the same pack. An 86 inform is not the worst, though. It'll help with some kind of SPC that they overpriced very soon. I've been really negative this video. I apologize. I do apologize. This isn't, this isn't usually me in videos. 
Okay, it's not. All right, anyway, we've got no walkout in this pack, though. We've got a board. I mean, we'll take that. Can it be anyone but Juan Mata? Brazilian, that's a good start. Striker, it's going to be Gabi Jesus. I've got a tradable version of my club, so we're going to swap those out. And I'll see the tradable version on the transfer list there. And we get Lucas as well. In fact, how many packs have we had where there's been some kind of link between the packs? I'm pretty sure Juan Mata had Pedro in the same pack. We had the two Man United midfielders. We had two Brazilians in the same pack. But two strikers in the same... I don't know. It is what it is. Anyway, last of the seven that I've completed. Can we get another walkout, please? Yes, we can. Three out of seven is really good. And it's blue. Come on. Please, someone good. French. Send it back. It's Laporte. That is really good. I'm not going to complain, actually. 94 rated blue. We'll take that. At least it's not one we've already got. I know I just went to the back, but that is actually good. I'll take that. It's decent. It's not too bad. 94 rated team of the season. It is not too shabby. Let's go ahead and take that. Imagine two in one pack. No, it's not. But it is Ben Mendy. A perfect link. Another like link in the pack. That is very weird. Anyway, I'll take that. Unfortunately, I'm going to complain a little bit because it's one that I can't use. But, I mean, it's a great pull. We will take that. Now, these packs are currently costing between 20 and 22,000 coins if you're to buy every single player like I have, unless you get them on bid for cheaper. They're all about 2,000 coins by now. Now, the best the best uh, way for you guys to complete this is to go on the market, make a list of 11 players. You can use my 11 players if you want to. You saw them on the screen, or you can make your own list of 11. Um, and what you want to do is you want to go to the market. You want to buy uh, four or five, depending on how many you want to do, uh, four or five of that exact player. Um, and then you go to your unassigned pile. I'm trying to figure out how to get to my unassigned pile from here. I think it's through Foot Central. You just want to go and try and open a pack and it won't let you. Get to your unassigned pile. And then once you've submitted 11 plays into the SBC, you'll notice that 11 of them actually become, uh, you know, basically uh, unassigned again. So you have the duplicates there. You can back out. So you've got all those duplicates saved. You want to go submit those 11 players into the SBC once again, uh, like so, like, I'll, like I'm doing here. It's the easiest and quickest way that I figured out how to do it. Um, you want to go ahead and submit all those 11 players in again um, as quickly as you... Well, it doesn't matter how quickly you do it, but you can do it at your own pace. Um, you want to submit those 11 players again. And once you submit them, you want to go back to the pack screen, try and open the pack. It will take you to the exact same screen that you were just at. And uh, and it's easy as that. Now, these players that I've got on the screen, do get yourself the chemistry. So uh, if you want to use the 11 players, you can. But I imagine if a lot of people use the 11 players, they might go up a little bit in price with everyone trying to buy the same players. So... It might be smarter if you didn't. Now, uh, as you see, we try and open a pack. Looks like you've got some items to deal with. And you'll see 11 players become unassigned once again. And not in the duplicates pile. Boom. And then we have 11 players left. Uh, they are the same 11 for the SBC. It's as easy as that. It's really not difficult at all. Uh, one thing I will say, they're very expensive. If you are to make essential profit on these SBCs, and that is, that is going basis, uh, on the basis of opportunity cost only. Therefore, if you were to submit this for 20 to 22,000 coins, you need either an 85 or an 84, two 85s or an 86 plus to make yourself any kind of, of break even slash profit on these packs. That is how ridiculously expensive they are in comparison to like other packs, for example, because 20,000 coins is a lot to pay for two players. It is a lot. So uh, if you are to try and break even on these, you'll realize it's very difficult. So I don't recommend doing it unless one, you have a ridiculous amount of untradeable Premier League rares or two, you have a ridiculous amount of coins and you just like spending them like me. 
because I am silly. I'm a very, I'm a, a very stupid person. Admittedly, I am doing it for content, but it's not a smart thing to do. If I were you, I wouldn't. I'd stay away. But if you just, either you're a gambler, you've got a lot of coins, you just feel like doing it, then if you want to go for a punt, then go for a punt, to be honest. But uh, but if you don't want to, or if you're contemplating it, you wonder if it's worth it or not, it's probably not worth it. Um, the most irritating part about this is these packs are actually really good as well. I've seen some very, very good return, um, which and that annoys me because and it's not me being ungrateful or anything like that. The reason that annoys me is because I wanted these packs to be really bad so that EA would change them. But I, I see a lot of people getting some really good pulls and I can't see EA changing them, to be honest. So... Either way, we've got five to open now for the video. Um, I realize it's probably dragging on a little bit, so I do apologize. But we've got five to open now. Hopefully, we can get at least one walkout in the five. Let's go with pack number four to start us off with and see if we can get anything decent. Now, we're not going to start off with a walkout. If we can get a board, that is all right, I guess. It has to be 85 or 84 for me to really care, though. It's going to be a Spanish goalie. It's going to be 84 Kepa. That's not too bad, to be fair. And 84 is decent. If we get two boards in one pack, that'd be, uh, that'd be all right, to be fair. Um, now, bearing in mind... If you've got a lot of untradeable duplicate Premier League players, I would recommend submitting them if you're going to open these because there's no point. Even if you have 83 or 84 duplicate Premier League players because there's no longer a duplicate unassigned glitch anymore as far as I'm aware. So it's no, there's no point holding on to them. Only hold on to players that you want to hold on to for SBCs or that you don't think you're going to repack. So, so don't submit 86s and 85s, but 84s and 83s I would submit because... I mean, it's very likely you will repack those exact same players. Now, we've got three left. I really hope we get a walkout from one of these five. It'd be very decent if we can. It's not going to come from this one, though. Not going to get a board in this one, either. That's actually really disappointing. These are these seem a lot worse than they were last night. Let me say, last night I did a few off-camera, and I packed a De Gea, I packed a Higuain. I packed some really decent players off-camera. So, um, apparently, yeah, a camera shy. and don't want to give me good players on camera. That is the vibe I'm getting right now, and that is, is backed up by four, or sorry, three non-boards in a row. If we not, if we don't get a walkout in this last pack, I deem these are not worth it anymore. Uh, compared to last night, I deem them not worth it. If there's no walkout in this, then they're not worth it, to be honest. That's the way I see it. No walkout. Don't don't waste your coins. That's ridiculous. Four four non -walk Right, okay. Yep, four non-boards. Four non boards out of five. Well done, EA. You really have ruined the SBC for most people. And then you've gone and given us absolutely nothing in the rewards. You've actually nerfed the packs, it seems like, overnight. Because let me tell you, last night I was packing walkouts galore. And today it just seems like they're just absolutely, absolutely rubbish. Now, we're going to submit all my untradeable Premier League plays we just got for one more. Because I'm an addict. I'm a, I'm a hypocrite. Um, and we'll see if we can get ourselves... Something to redeem those absolutely awful packs. In fact, I think I've only got I think I only got 10 players back, so I don't see myself being able to do this. Done one last one. EA, you better give me a blue to, to compensate for what I've just seen. EA, come on. Do it to me. Do it to me, EA. We'll open in the last one. Come on. <laughs> it's not a walkout. It's a board. I really don't care. I really don't care. They've ruined my favorite SBCs of the year. They're giving us absolutely nothing in return. And they've seemed to have nerfed the packs. That is it. Take take from this what you will. If you think they're worth it, you want to do them, then feel free. And tweet me your pack pulls down in the description. There's a, a link to my Twitter. Tweet me who you get. I'd love to see if you guys are getting some sick pulls because that would that'd make me happier than I am right now. Uh, and if you don't want to do it, then I don't blame you because... Yeah, EA man. Sometimes, sometimes they do some amazing things in the game, and other times they do stuff like this, and they just completely ruin it. So, thank you for watching, and I'll see you lads later.